Come here. <laughs> oh, that's great. Damn it, Cosworth. Oh, my. I didn't mean to fall in here. Damn it. Burn all of you. <laughs> Battle Tested Beast Productions, this is Ibaka. This is where we left off. There is a dick on top of this roof that has a piggy bank rocket launcher who continues to murder my face. I don't know what I did to him, I can't remember. It's been hours since I recorded that last episode, man. Or days, who really knows? I know for a fact that I know that this man has to be dealt with. This has gotten personal. Uh, we were having fun. You know, some good laughs. Where, where is my, why is it doing this? Give me my gun. <laughs> no glitches, Todd Howard, please. Listen, man, I gotta go deal with this, bro. All right? He got piggy bank mines everywhere. They're harder to disarm than regular mines. Thank you, Kazi. He's sitting on top of the roof. He up there chilling with his homies. You know what I'm saying? I'm sure they scratching his balls every so often. I don't care. All right, he didn't took me out twice, I believe. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it was twice on camera, so we're gonna say it was twice. I have to find a way to deal with this person. He has caused me great irritation. You know what I'm saying? I gotta go get that back in blood. And then I'm gonna run his pockets because why not? All right, that is the American way. <laughs> okay, so new strategy. Nope, you deal with that if you want to. New strategy, I'm gonna try to get in a position where he can't see me. I think that I better understand where he's located on top of the building. I'm gonna do my best to uh, blast his ass from the, from the other side of the fat man but he found it or he built it i don't care i'm gonna take it and shove it down his fucking throat what is that because this has gotten ridiculous man I, I don't think i've been unalived this much in a playthrough yet by one person okay i think he's on that roof let me quick save it bro for no reason just because he's he keep he keep getting me and it happens when you least expect it it just he just pop off bro so I gotta be a little smarter. There he is. Got you now. Fucking shit. <laughs> oh, that's great. Yeah, ain't so tough now, are you? Yeah. Now we can go deal with his little boyfriend. Oh, damn it. Come here, Kazi. I done got too heavy again. What is it actually called? What, what? Piggy bank, fat man, that is crazy. Cosworth can't carry that, okay. Can he carry this? No? Too heavy out here, Kazi. Here, I know what I'm gonna do, this is a hack. If you drop something on the ground hey. and tell Kazi to pick it up, take that weapon. he'll pick it up. Come get this fat man, Kazi. Hurry up, they're shooting you. There you go, see, that's how you do that. Okay. Now we good. Yeah, your big homie is down now. I took him out, so you ain't too tough now, are you? Gotta watch out for these damn piggy banks. Back up, back up. The piggy bank is strong, the fat man is strong. The fat man piggy bank. I don't, I don't know who made this, but they're a son of a bitch. Cause I didn't got taken out like four times by this little crew right here, bro. This is actually kind of embarrassing, but that's okay. It's still a jolly good time, <laughs> or something along those lines. Anybody else up here? Any more piggy banks? Ugh. Why? 
Somebody lit a cigar and didn't get to finish it. What a shame. Okay, bro. What you got for me, man? Oh, grenade launch schematics. Hell yeah. What else? Return the schematics to Suggs. I didn't know Suggs is who I was doing this for, but I might kill him. I might kill Suggs because I didn't die a few times. Who is it? Who? What up, bro? What's happening? Oh, what is that? What is he shooting? Quick save. No reason. What the hell he got? What are all these exotic weapons? Okay, I think that's just a junk jet. And that's a car. Wonderful. Yeah, reload so I can shoot you while you reload. Perfect. <laughs> oh, that's great. We all good? Y'all done? Never done this quest before in my life. Oh, yeah, bro. You dumb. Where you going? Come here. <laughs> all right. What's turpentine? Run that. Suggs? You still alive, bro? Baseball grenade. Baseball. It's a baseball launcher. I've never heard of a baseball hey, launcher. Get the launcher. Grab that. There you go, Kazi. What up, Suggs? I took care of your light work, bro. I really didn't want to, so you should pay me money. I buy and sell. Just put up everything you've got and let's see if we can make a deal. Hear anything lately? If you don't mind, prefer to just talk shop for now. A lot of quality goods here. Okay. I've got a few minutes to browse. I thought I was supposed to hand you something. What is happening right now? Return the schematics to Suggs, okay? <clears throat> hey. Thanks for your help. Penetrating Chinese grenade launcher rifle? Ignores 30... This is crazy as hell, bro. Awesome. Hey, Scabber. Let's trade. Sure. Let's take a look. Okay, so I just got, like... I hate talking like this, but a shit ton of uh, new weapons. I'm going to continue this trend of doing side quests because apparently they're awesome. But first, me and Kazi should probably take a trip back back on to the home front really quickly. Just real quick. Cosworth, I may need you to carry some more stuff. I'm at 376, bro. I'm so heavy. Oh my gosh. Yeah, I'll, I'll cut this out. Yeah, bro. Uh, I ain't gonna lie to you. It's getting crazy out in the wasteland. You know what I'm saying? Stuff been popping off. I done met a few new gangs. The Enclave has returned to destroy me again. I don't, I don't know why this is happening. But uh, I need to make some moves. And this outfit is corny as hell. I need, I need some new clothes too, bro. We're gonna have to figure this out. You know, there's nothing wrong with being a dapper gentleman. I think I'm gonna wear this tuxedo for no reason. And I'm gonna attack the Enclave with their own armor. That would make me truly happy. Here we go. Look at this beautiful bastard. Oh man, that look good. Let's go. And again, this is a side quest episode. <laughs> I can I completely understand that uh <laughs> Valentine is in purgatory. He'll be alright. Do you have a minute? What do you no? No, I don't uh Fine. When we first met, I admit, I had my doubts about you, but you've done nothing but impress me. You're just who the Minutemen needed to bring us back from the brink. Thanks. That means a lot coming from you. You've probably realized by now how important the Minutemen are to me. When I was a kid, the Minutemen were my heroes. Uh-huh. They were the only good guys around, really. Right. When I turned 17, I joined up with Ezra Hollis's company. Oh, God. He was one of the good ones. 
Press really game. believed in the old time minute man way. I want to kill the enclave. Years there. I felt like I was part of something bigger than me. Like I was really helping make the Commonwealth a better place. Uh huh. It sounds like you were really making a difference. I think we were. I know we were. But obviously it didn't last. I'm sure there was a lot I didn't see or know enough to pay attention to. Oh, you know, man. The politics and rivalries and bad blood between the different groups. Right, I right. I guess General Becker was able to keep a lid on it, keep everyone more or less on the same team. But after he was killed, it all came out in the open. I couldn't believe it at first. These guys were supposed to be Minutemen. They were supposed to put their duty to the people ahead of everything else. You probably think I was pretty naive, huh? Yes. I guess I was. Still am, too. Yes, you are. Even after everything. I still believe that the Minutemen can be what I always thought they were. The good guys. Wonderful. We are the good guys. We're doing our best. And a lot of it has to do with your example. That's right. So I guess what I'm trying to say is, thanks. You're welcome. Anyway, now please. I appreciate you taking the time to listen. Yeah. Just... Anytime, Preston. Thanks, man. We'd probably better get back to it. Yes. For God's sake. <laughs> I just realized he sleeps on his right side and he never takes that hat off. That is sad. Okay, so we are officially looking for the Enclave and it is now nighttime. I'm gonna take a little nap in my tuxedo. And we will continue this journey in the morning. Back hurts, feet hurt. Ugh. Everything hurts. I am really sorry to hear that, ma'am. And I wish I could help. But I need to go and destroy the Enclave once again. I can't... Re Can somebody remind me? I don't remember if the Enclave was actually destroyed in Fallout 3. I don't think they were. I, I don't remember. I know you had, like, an option to destroy the world or to, you know, save the world, but you had to sacrifice yourself. I never did it. I always made the dude's daughter do it. And I, I felt pretty bad about that, actually, for, for a while. But after a while, you realize you can go back. That's what I have. You can go back and ask her to sacrifice herself instead, which is just hilarious because she resents you and then dies. So I want to try this baseball gun, baseball launcher. Let me see. Baseball something. Awesome. Bro, a baseball gun sounds crazy as hell. Baseballs are hard. If you get hit with a baseball, my, my boy, in the head, you're done. It's lights out for you, you know what I'm saying? It's game over, you know, it's, it's, it's all done now. So I'm gonna try to shoot people in the face with baseballs at 200 miles per hour and see how they like it. I doubt they like it at all. <laughs> I'm talking nonsense. All right, bro. Got plenty of time left, plenty of open space wilderness for pew pewing. I got my little handy dandy handgun and we are off into the wasteland, Kazi. Oh, God, they didn't kill the mailman. Why would y'all do that? I was expecting something in the mail, damn it. Ugh. Letter, letter, letter. Sorry, bro. Oh, it's a lady. You killed a woman. Filthy bastard. She was a male woman. How often do you see that? I don't see it enough. Whoops. Cosworth, thank you. Okay, she dropped some letters. I'm gonna see if I can read them. When you read letters, it gives you like clues and stuff to different areas. And considering all the awesome weapons I found in the past few playthroughs, I'm gonna read those letters. It just said letter, it didn't have like a name. Let's see, a uh, letter. Corey, I'm telling you, man, this gig is top notch. This place is right near a road and we just grab caravans as they go by and we live like kings. So y'all robbing people, they, they robbing people. Y'all some lames. I'll be over there to end you. You feel me? What's up with this one? Joel. Great name. When the hell are you getting back? I can't believe you left this stupid thing with me. A mole rat is not a gosh darn pet. It chews on balls and then craps all over your balls. This is not worth it. I don't care how much you're paying me. Get back here. Well, I say eat it. Let me see. Last letter. Uh, look, Cole, I know you're sick of working for Bobby, but don't leave good neighbor. You don't know how good you got it. Hun, steady jobs, decent place to live. Good neighbor's not decent. And you got Hancock to 
bash some heads in if you get out of line. Uh, Rick, is time, Rick is taking over the gang here in College Square, blah, 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 blah. Love, Eris. Wonderful. So we got one place to visit. One new place to visit. That's cool. I'll check that out later. For now, let's get back to the Enclave. Focus on <laughs> one quest at a time. It's almost impossible in this game. That's another one of my settlements over there. At least it will be. I can't remember if I helped them out already or not, but I'm not doing that right now. Over there, I believe that's Saugus Sausage Ironworks. Pretty sure that's how you say it. I'm not dealing with them right now. They love fire because they are insane. As long as you don't run up on me, bro, ain't gonna be no problems. You feel me? We all good. We all good. I see you, super mutants. <laughs> oh, that's great. Can I pick the baseballs back up? At oh, I can pick them back up. Let's go. Run all that. I'm not dealing with y'all right now. Fire grenades, movement orders. Awesome. I'm not fighting the sausage works, people. I'm not doing it. Cosworth, no. No, no. No, no. Hey. Come, come back over here. Over here. I'm not fighting them right now. I don't want to deal with them. Actually, Cosworth, since you went over there, you on your own. I, I told you not to go over there. Quick save for no reason. Tired of dying. I told him. I told him not to go over there. So that's on him. You know what I'm saying? I'm out. All right? <laughs> Cosworth is dead. Seriously, I don't... I don't know why he chose death. He didn't have to. Is this it? This is y'all's secret base? Y'all are a bunch of pussies. Oh lord, oh lord. Uh-uh. We're not doing this. That's right, shoot him, not me. Pay for your sins against the wasteland. Oh god. Oh it's all over. Oh no. Oh. <laughs> Alright, that was round one, you know what I'm saying? Let me get some food. Be alright. I ain't got no backup. Since Cosworth is chasing sausages. There you go, sweetness. Okay, turret. Okay, I hear you. It's time for you to take a nap now. Go ahead and rest. This is it? I was expecting like a big base camp or something. It's just y'all? You suck. <laughs> Suffer. <laughs> uh... This baseball gun was the way to go. Whoops, I didn't mean to strip you naked, bro. I just wanted your gun. And the fact that you can pick the baseballs back up is everything, dog. Hmm. Who are you shooting at? Come here! Oh, Kazi, you made it! Thought you were dead. Kill the hostile soldiers, read the terminal for information. Okay. Y'all got some cool stuff, though. Why y'all just burning people and wasting Brahm and me? Sick bastards. Got a good melon, though. Okay. They said to read the terminal. Ooh, what's that? Oh, what, bro? Even in Fallout 3, you would see these damn crates looking super fancy and dirty. And there gotta be something in there, right? Nothing. That's nonsense. I need a break. Ugh. All right, bro. Nothing in this one either. Wonderful. Quick nap. Okay, let's see what else they got for me here. Retrieval logs, can't find power map. Maybe incinerator. Tesla cannon. That sounds awesome. It's two power potential notes to refer to the Commonwealth of Massachusetts. Expression of a set. Intelligence is working. Oh, okay. So these are just notes about me. I stole something from the wrong people, and now they're coming after me. That's fun. PMC named Gunners are in possession of an especially large quantity of plasma cartridges. Tactical advantages present themselves. Okay. Establish discrete encampment in AO. <laughs> AO. And produce Fortnightly? Nah. 
Reports to superiors regarding occurrences of note in the vicinity. Identify locations of missing equipment. Why did you bring the equipment here if you didn't want us to go missing? Why? Track the Enclave homing beacon within the glowing sea. Start the search from the edge of the glowing sea. The glowing sea? Man, I don't want to go out there, bro. But I will. Glowing sea is crazy. Wonderful. Um, Kazi. I murdered, or excuse me, I unalived an Enclave officer, and I need you to take their power armor stuff. Where'd they go? Yeah. See if he had anything worth taking. He definitely does. Oh, I can't take his armor. Oh, wait, sorry. <laughs> That's not it. There's an actual soldier who I put down. Where'd he go? No, not the turret. Don't expect the turret. There was a man in a power armor suit. Where'd he go? That's unfortunate. Not going down there. There he is. Grab anything useful. Nap Napalmer. Enclave tags. Military fatigues, napalmer. I don't I just want the power armor stuff. Goes for a pretty penny. Let us continue on this mystery quest that just popped up. I thought everybody in Enclave was dead. Not at all. Not at all. Good. Cosworth stripped them. Let's go to the glowing sea. That is a bit of a hike, though. Oh, man. Start the search from the edge of the glowing sea. All I know about the glowing sea is there is a ton of radiation. I guess I'm going to have to start in Jamaica Plain. Wonderful. Okay. I really don't care to go through Jamaica Plain. There's like a ton of ghouls, bro. Uh, that I don't want to deal with. I, I wish I could go around them. I'm going to try to go around it. Eh. And I'm not afraid of ghouls. They're just... They can be pretty tough. Cause me to use a lot of ammo. That's why I don't like fighting ghouls. Especially like the green glowy ones. You know, who is that for? You know, I don't, I don't understand. <sighs> this place has gone straight to hell. Nothing good comes to this place. And there's nothing Jamaican about this area, by the way. I wonder uh, who named this that? Why, why named this that? There is nothing Jamaican here. Jamaica is a beautiful place. Even though the people are there are really poor. Makes me sad. And we go there to like visit, you know what I'm saying? But kind of want to help Jamaica. Uh... Sorry. Don't hit my robot. <laughs> Come here, sweetness. <laughs> Tactical tune, pipe, knuckles. What you got? Nothing else? They were just out here chilling, too. I didn't have to do that. But I feel like if they would have saw me, they would have just killed me anyway. Let me see what you got. Oh, heck yeah. All right, Kazi, we clear. All right, I thought we were clear. Sit still. Oh my gosh. Bro, go to sleep. Ugh. I'm looking for the Enclave. You are not on that list. Let me see. And I know there's a big... Yeah, Gunner Compound. That's where the Gunners are, I believe. Gunners are a gang that dress like the military, but op operate like any other gang. I thought they were soldiers at first. They are not. They some hoes, and they're going to be dealt with. All right? Just not today. I'm busy. Let me see. Pretty sure if you... Yeah, that happens. <laughs> uh. You know, you're no Walter White, pal. All right? You're no Heisenberg. You shouldn't be doing this stuff by yourself. You don't even have a Jesse in here. Uh, I think he was making some kind of prison liqueur. Some people can't shake that lifestyle when they get out. He just got a bunch of crap. I'm out. I don't want to deal with the gunners. The gunners are actually pretty tough to their credit. Kind of hard to kill. I'm cool. 
We're supposed to be making our way to the Red Sea. I think that's what it said. Damn it. I see some of the mosquitoes. Ha ha! Take that, hatchling. Whoop. Damn it! <laughs> now I'm going to eat you. How does that make you feel? Okay. Let us make our way, Kadzi. You know what's crazy, bro? I never really thought of Fallout as dark, but the actual reality of this happening is horrifying, especially with the state of reality. Like, I can't imagine living like this. <sighs> Sorry, bro. If I didn't do it, you would have got up and went all zombie on me. Hmm. I'm actually running out of space. Silent Kazu. We have company. Hmm. Two ball, no, I'm good. Let's just keep on moving, man. What is that? It looks like a floating shield. What is that? That is so weird. Cutler Ben. Oh no. I'm using my baseball launcher. I ain't got time for y'all. <laughs> oh, that's great. Give my baseballs back, Trick. I'm so glad you can pick these back up. That is amazing. Now, don't run now. You saw what I did to you, little homie. And you scared now. Back up. You see me reloading back up. <laughs> oh, that's great. Cosworth, you handle that. I'm going to move on along here. I'm pretty sure there's a Mylar King around here. Or, or Queen. I don't really want to deal with that. Damn it. What is in this trailer? I could really use a bed right now. I'm exhausted, man. Chemistry jar? Is there anything in it? Is this a jar? I'm good. Hmm. Right away, stem pack, maybe. Yep. Awesome, cool find. Where'd he go, Kazi? I see he whooped your ass because you on the ground again. So where he at? Nah, I'm good. I just want to make my way through here peacefully, you know? I don't really see how that's possible, but I'm about to try it. Oh, no! <laughs> no! Don't fall into the water. Oh, no! <laughs> oh. There are many lessons to be learned from this. This is not one of them. Can you attack me in the water? Oh, damn, he can! Oh, no! Oh, God! Oh, no! Back up! Oh, no! No, 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 no! All of y'all some tricks back up. Oh my gosh. I didn't want no smoke, bro. I th <laughs> Why? Back up. You 269 gods, stay away. I smack you with baseballs. Damn it, Cosworth. Oh, man. Oh, no. I don't want that. Uh, what else do I got? Damn it, Gunners, help me out. <laughs> I know y'all in there. Oh, gosh. Thank you, Gunners. This is what I'm going to do, okay? I'm going to get inside the Gunners compound, and then I'm going to make them fight each other. Here we go. Oh, gosh. Oh, no. Quick save for no reason. There we go. Where'd they go? Come in here. Come in here and fight the gunners. That's how you do that. See? That, now my enemies are fighting each other. And now I can make my escape. Pretty sure there's a word for that. That's okay. <laughs> oh, that's great. Ah. <sighs> Kazi? <laughs> 
That got a little crazy, bro. That's my bad. You know what I'm saying? I don't know where you went, but that wasn't completely my fault. Uh, I don't know they was gonna do all that. The hell? Oh. Why? Oh. It's just one monster after the next. Please. <laughs> I just want to go to the Red Sea. There you go. There you go. Overdrive? What the hell is that? Why is there a third one? Nah, fam. Nah. There's got to be another way around here. Um, I don't... That up. Okay, Kodzi. There's one more monster I gotta deal with, bro. This is getting out of hand. Where his punk ass go? There he is. He's on a boat. I don't think he can jump, so I'm just gonna try to rush him and hope for the best. How do I use? Haha, <laughs> not for long. Haha, <laughs> look at that. Who just hit me? Oh, he hit me. Okay. <laughs> he mad now. He mad. You mad, fam? You mad? Damn it, Cosworth, move! Oh. Oh my gosh. Punk bitch. Bro, I swear, bro. Will you please? Finally! Ugh! Okay. Can I make that jump? I can make that jump. Let's go. What's this? Oh, heck yeah. Run that. No copyright. Okay. That got a little crazy. <laughs> but uh, we should be able to continue on here. Oh, look, a clubhouse. Or a treehouse. That's pretty cool. I just heard something pop out of the ground and I'm looking down at my phone. I hope it doesn't hit me before I can attack. Okay, good. Damn it, Cosworth. Handle my light work. I want to go in the treehouse. Damn it. Damn it. Okay, what's in here? Some delicious bullets, dirty water, anything else? Quick save for no reason. Okay. I think I'm done fighting you guys. I'm just gonna leave. I've had enough now. I'm just gonna leave. I'll see you later. You know? Uh, it was fun. I had a good time, but I think that's enough now. You know? Just gonna head on out into the dark, stormy night. And be on my way to the Enclave. Or, excuse me, the Red Sea. I gotta get to the Red Sea before I go to the Enclave. So there's that. And uh, Cosworth is dead again. So there's that. That is a super mutant hideout. I'm not going in there. I just fought <laughs> Mirelark Kings. And I got seven minutes left before I have to close shop and go down to the candy shop. Not too sure why I said that. All right. Uh, so many monsters, so little time. What else is going on? The NFL season started. It was nice to see the Ravens lose to the Chiefs because of their mistakes. I don't know what this fascination is with going for it on fourth down all the time. What is that? I want to see what's in there. But coaches are going for it on fourth down, like, all the time now in the NFL. What is, bro, a punt can be a good thing. A lot of things can happen when you punt the ball. Some of them good, you know, but obviously it's a calculated risk. But the Baltimore Ravens should really practice punting more. I know Lamar Jackson is trustworthy. I like Lamar. You know, franchise quarterback, great quarterback, all that. But, bro, sometimes you got to punt that ball. 
Uh, I can't believe the Ravens lost by a toe. I kind of wanted that game to go into overtime because I feel like those are the two best in the game right now. Lamar Jackson and Patrick Mahomes, that is. Oh, good to have Cosworth back. But, yeah. Ravens earn that L, bro. I don't, I don't like teams that go for it on fourth down all the time. Like, sometimes, bro, you got to punt that ball. Where am I supposed to go? <laughs> I thought I was going the right way. Yeah, I'm going the right way. The only thing I remember about the Red Sea is the radiation. And the death claws. So I'm probably not going to be over here long. Oh, and the ghouls. How quaint. How is it that the Enclave is surviving over here? Oh! <laughs> Why? So many monsters, so little time. Oh, you poisoned me with your appearance. Ugly bastard. Run up. What up, Terrence? Goodbye, Terrence. Not too sure why you're wearing a dress there. <laughs> Ow. Cosworth, do your job, you filthy bastard. Die! <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh, now this is just nasty. Okay, don't want to get too close to the radiation. You know what? You mind your business, bro. I'm going to leave you alone. He's just taking a nap. How often do you see ghouls take a nap, you know? Is this the Red Sea? Am I here? Oh, the glowing sea. I kept saying Red Sea. What is that from? Okay. I'm supposed to look for the Enclave out here? This is actual factual hell. I don't want to be here. I can barely see. The quality of these videos is already questionable. Like, I, this is not good, man. We need to hurry up and find an enclave. I don't like this at all. Ain't no sunshine. You know what I'm saying? There's no little Rufuses coming out of the ground. Like, one thing is for damn sure, I am sure to run into a death claw. So I'm gonna go ahead and save it before I head to church. I think that's a church over there in the distance. The bomb must have fell like right here. We are literally actually factually standing where the bomb dropped because this is just awful. Oh, I can't even hang out out here. What is that moving in the distance? Nope. I'm just going to church. Make our way to the church. This is where the Enclave needs to be. Some dirty bastards. Pope's March Pentecostal Church. Oh, <laughs> I have never seen so many ghouls gathered in one place. That's probably at church when the bombs dropped. That's crazy. Um, I think I'm just sniping from up here, bro. Yeah, this is a good idea. This is smart. So smart. I wish I had like a bomb to drop. Damn it. Can they come up here? I don't know how they get up here. I don't think they can get out of the church. So, that, don't you fall. Ooh, I almost fell. <laughs> ah. Oh my, I didn't mean to fall in here, damn it. Burn all of you. <laughs> that was not by design, no. <laughs> Quick save. Uh, what are you looking at, huh? Huh? Weak ass. Defiant combat shotgun? The final shot in the magazine deals twice? No, I'm gonna just sell that. Oh, shoot. I done got too heavy. Gotta drop something. I don't, I don't care about that. All right. Oh! <laughs> Back your ass up. Come here, no, don't be, dip, don't be dipping. 
I'm gonna be dipping and ducking. I wanna see what's in that chest. Oh, hell yeah. Ow! Why? Where you at? Respect it. Always respect my gangster. Laundry dress. I don't need a dress. Why y'all always trying to give me a dress? Clean blue suit. Hell yeah. What's that? Pre-war money. Hell yeah. Always pick up pre-war money in spite of what some YouTubers think. <laughs> pre-war money can come in handy. Good night, Martha. You beautiful woman. Yeah, gonna transform, bro. Since you out here smacking people, I'm gonna smack you around a little bit. Give me that arm. And that leg. Yeah. Two shot, what does that mean? Shoots an additional projectile? Okay. That's what's up. Not too heavy yet. Yeah, there's some cool stuff down here. Uh, but you know what? <laughs> Battle Tested Beast Productions, this has been pretty fun. I'm gonna go ahead and call it here in this church. Thank you so much for watching. I'm not sure where Cosworth is. Maybe he played it smart and stayed on the surface, unlike me, slowly getting irradiated and dying. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye now.